So guys, um, this is day two of the um, the GTA prison, basically. Um, and Rockstar, not Rockstar, the uh, police have very kindly given me a a set of, a, a change of clothes. Yeah, they've they've given me a change of clothes. I can use the prison outfit because this is what this these lobbies are. Um, so experiences so far, it's basically like a post-apocalyptic wasteland. Here's probably the best way to describe it. Um, there's there's just explosions everywhere. Literally about every second, the little screen on the left just go straight to the top of my TV screen of messages saying oh this person killed this person this person killed this person oh this person chose the easy way out oh CEO oh died orbital cannon orbital cannon orbital cannon and so on as you can probably tell um at the moment I am in a private session just to do this and you know, to have a bit of time where I'm not in passive mode because I'm spending a lot of time in passive mode. Um, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to try and find. There we go. <coughs> I'm going to try and find a session uh, filled with people of bad sports. And I'll be able to literally give you a. Um, a proper taste of how this all is. Um, but I don't even know if this is going to work because I've got the stream going on my computer uh, and it keeps freezing. So it's probably not going to work. But we will just have to probably wait and see. And to see what happens. So. Yeah, this is going to be a short one. But yeah, day two of the GTA prison, known as a bad sport lobby. In the moment of, at the point of recording this, I've actually got. Two hours left. So, just wait for it to load. That's the only problem. Even though it's bad sport, there's actually quite a few lobbies or sessions um, when it comes to bad sport. There's actually quite a lot. I'm actually surprised. Uh, no one is underneath level 100. So. I think the lowest person I've seen was level 117. So, um, yeah, just wait for this to load. Still, it still takes a while. Is this like an extra punishment, Rockstar? Hmm. You bad sports, so we're going to give you a slow loading screen. Is that all that is? Cause this is just ridiculous. Anyway, might as well while we wait. Uh let you people know on the channel what's going on. Basically, you could probably have told by now I do a lot of different things. Um at the moment. Ooh, wow, I just got told to shut up. That's wait what? So I was there's been an error joining. Okay, I mean, I didn't actually jo I didn't even manage to join it, so I don't know what that was about. But yeah, basically, what's going on with the channel is, like I said, I do a lot of different things. So instead of it just being scattered, I'm going to have it split into sections. So I'm going to start with my main bit, reactions. Cause that's my probably me, not most popular, but most regular thing that happens. Um, then 
down to gaming and then stories and in each section I'm going to have playlists of different things so the reactions I'm going to have well the reaction type things I've got so I've got reactions subscriber specials and I might do film reactions, TV reactions, gaming reactions, subscriber specials, something like that gaming it's just going to be whatever maybe the different types of games because I'm still planning on doing the whole sims thing so um, and then obviously the stories stories I've already got in the kind of the, sec the um, things they are I have done the second guardians film it's just I need to do some editing on it because I did upload it but it's been blocked worldwide because of two scenes that I'm used on it so I need to sort that out um, so there is going to be two scenes that were um, that was video, but I've had to make it so they are, well I'm going to have to make it so they're screenshots, not screenshots, freeze frames. Um, just to keep the people happy. And some more typing. Which is going to be fun for me. Or am I. I don't know. I'll think, I'll, I'll think of a way to work around it. I don't know. Well, the stream's kind of caught up a bit. Not laggy anymore, which is good. Still in the um There we go. I've just been given the message of unable to join the session. So it's not that far behind. It's about the Ooh, just hit the mic. <sighs> this has turned out to be one long video, people because of these loading screens really uh, I could have just stayed I don't know <coughs> I'm also not feeling very well still I'm getting better oh the sky has changed am I joining? nope unable to join wow that's just stupid ridiculous and just downright annoying I'm gonna try again if it doesn't work then I'm gonna have to just go to an invite only session again <sighs> which is no fun <sighs> or we can try and join. no we can't try and join because we got no friends that are on and all the friends that we have on are not in a bad sport lobby so let's give this one more go <coughs> Or I don't know. Also, I'm probably planning on doing this most nights. Um, doing like a little live stream and then putting it on the channel. So, if there is anyone watching this and you want to come tag along, um, just leave a comment down below. With your gamer tag, I'll give you a message over Xbox, and we'll see what we can do. Um, I am planning on trying to get in touch with someone else who does Xbox GTA. He's actually the only person that I've managed to see who does Xbox, because everyone else either does PC or PlayStation. So I'm gonna try and get in touch with him. See if we can do a little something together. Because I know he's in bad sport as well at the moment, so I don't know. It might not. I might happen. It might not. I don't know. What's the time? If anyone's wondering, it is currently ten to ten in the country of UK, which is where I am based. Oh wow, these loading screens. Well, there you go. You get a little message: high-end vehicles and key property discounts. Good for you. In case you're wondering, it's Pegasus Centorno, 
at 35% off the Neon, the v Vis, Visa, Neo, <coughs> whatever, 25% off the Comet SR, 35% off, and the MC Clubhouse and Renovations, 50% off. So that's, uh, that's that. Still in the loading screen. Probably not going to join because this happened last night and I had to turn the Xbox off um, for about, I think it was like 20 minutes. Turn it back on and it worked. So, oh, look at that. A game clip uploaded to Xbox Live. Well, whoopity bloody do for you. <coughs> It's not going to work, is it? It would have done it by now. I'm going to have to join an invite only. Join in it. Do an invite. Okay. Things, I can hear explosions. I'm in the session. I can hear things blowing up. Why will it not let me do anything? That's the annoying thing. I can hear things blowing up. So just let me do stuff in the session. I'm in it, obviously, because I can hear it. So just let me in. Let me do stuff. Let me do what I need to do. Not that I have not that I have anything that I need to do. I just want to do something. If that's, you know, at all possible, Rockstar. You know, because there's a lot of things <coughs> that you fail us on. So Oh Hold up. Something just happened at the back screen. Anyway, while we wait. Um, update. Oh, there we go. Unable to join. What the bloody hell is the point, mate? Okay. Um, anyway. I'm going to uh, just do an invite only. <laughs> what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Update <coughs> on Rockstar's behalf. Well, not behalf, but something to do with Rockstar and GTA um fixing the servers no they're not I'm I'm sorry everyone who is gonna go down a hell and take some art to make it freeze uh yeah that's not gonna happen anytime soon no it is um I don't know if it's rumored or fact um but the last DLC uh, that Rockstar are doing is at the moment I think it's called C Cops and Crooks um, so finally we will probably be able to purchase police vehicles and store them not sure about customizing them if we can it will be awesome <coughs> a couple things I hope for one mainly customization wise but one if we can buy the vehicles I hope we can remove the um what's it called deliveries on it so it literally just looks like a plane car um remove the light from the top of the car, but also add lights to other vehicles. Now, if we could add police lights or different colored lights onto the roofs of cars, I think that would look awesome. It would be really cool if we could do that. Um, but I don't think that's going to happen, but if it does, that would be awesome. Um, Obviously, police outfit. Please God, Rockstar, let us have a bloody police outfit for once. You let us have so much stuff. There's sometimes where we have to glitch police outfits on so we can use them. And you stop that from happening. We used to be able to get into the police station. You stop that from happening. Come on, I mean, seriously, there are so many other things that you can need to fix 
and you fix the things that are actually fun. You don't stop people with orb and cannon glitch because apparently there's a new one. And you're not stopping that fast enough. I mean, there's a way to be able to shoot through walls with a heavy sniper. I sometimes do that. Just because I'm helping people. But you don't fix that. And I get accused of hacking, modding and cheating. So, you know, it's not my fault your game is bugged, but don't fix things that are fun. Like the cargo plane thing with the back door. Why fix that? What harm is that causing to anyone? Is that causing problems for other players? No. It made one, it made out of everything you can do in this game, missions, jobs, races, everything, it made one thing easier to do and for some reason that is enough for it to get fixed and unable to be used again. It was one thing delivering a bloody van across the map because the vans are slow as hell and you, you stop that from right happening. So just let us have a goddamn police outfit, what is so wrong with that? Literally, we can wear literally everything. I've seen people, I've seen female characters literally walk around with nothing on. But you won't let us actually wear something. Anyway, continuing with the topic at hand. Um, uh, yeah, so yeah, the, the, the removing deliveries, be cool. removing or adding the lights, again, cool. Letting us wear police outfits, cool. Let us into police stations, and if we have a police outfit on, we should be allowed, like, we should be allowed to be, like, cops. So obviously, if you go around in a police outfit, it's like killing everyone for no reason. Okay, yeah, they're gonna make the police come after us. But if we are literally, we are, if we are actually trying to chase down someone, like another player, who has killed someone, or even if a player has police on them who are shooting them, if you are in a police outfit, you should be allowed to assist the cops in taking down that player and shoot them and not get cops on them yourself. Because at the moment, if you try and help the police, they will turn around and shotgun you in the face for trying to help. They will shotgun you in the face if you get crashed into by them. Like, they are... <coughs> they are crazy. So let us help them, for God's sake. Because I think it would be pretty cool having people going around being cops. It would, it would make this game much more of a role-playing game. Because I think this game would be awesome as an RPG. I know there is an RPG version, but I think it'd be awesome, to be honest, if we could do that. Because we've got nightclubs, we can run a nightclub. We've got hangars, we can run air shipments, yeah, but they may be illegal, but it's a job. <coughs> um, CEOs, we can run businesses. Yeah, again, they may be illegal, but no, it's a job. It will just be awesome if we could just do everything the Piggleese can do. Within reason, obviously. Um, so, also, have the police help be able to purchase the police helicopter and actually be able to repel down from the um, side. Doors. That again would be cool. That really would. Maybe even past the pilot repels down, it sets the helicopter autopilot and you repel down and then once you're on the floor and let go of the line, the helicopter automatically either flies back or it despawns automatically. Again that'll be cool. Um but I've Along with the outfits debate, have more than one, or have 
like pre-made outfits from the till or the cashier, depending on what country you're in and how you phrase that. Um, but obviously, it have the different options as selective clothes. So helmets have SWAT have like actual <coughs> SWAT helmets and L um, what's it called? LSPD bomber jackets and long sleeved shirts, badges, bloody gun belts. If you, we could have a gun belt, that would be sick. Like having a gun belt like they do and having different things on it or even have different types of gun belts so you've got a light, a light gun belt where it's literally just a pistol a gun belt with just like a pistol slot and whichever pistol you have activated serious oh right <clears throat> I'm, I need to keep this stream going to see where it stopped because I've literally just looked at my controller and my microphone was turned off <coughs> and I don't know how long it's been turned off for. I've just been having a massive rant about the police update that's possibly going to happen. But I now might have to leave it until next time. Because... Uh, it's, it hasn't recorded any of my sound. Because at some point I've hit the mute mic button or the mute button, whatever. And I ha it hasn't recorded anything that I was saying. Yeah. <sighs> It didn't record anything. Oh my god. Oh, well, that is just fantastic. Right. Well, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, we're going to come back tomorrow. Um, because I'm probably going to still be in bad sport. We're going to leave it there. It's half. It's been half an hour. This thing. I don't know. I may have only been talking for about five minutes of it. I, God, don't know. So I'm just going to leave it here. So any any comments you want to say, just leave so in the bottom. Don't forget to sub, uh, like the video if you enjoyed my little rant that you wouldn't. We never hear because I pre I very much enjoyed. Yep, I enjoyed recording it uh, and not actually recording it. So yeah.